for Best Solo Girl website, tastevens.com. So Taste Stevens is up for the Best Solo Girl. How do you, how do you get nominated? Uh, I guess I was nominated by the people that, uh, that run AVN, and they thought that my site was worthy of a nomination, which I'm very honored to have. So you didn't have to give anybody a blowjob or anything like oh, that? I would never do that for an award. <laughs> I win everything with hard work. No doubt, no doubt. <laughs> so how long, have you ha how long have you had your website going? Um, it's been going for a good 10 years now, um, but it's just finally starting to come into its own shape. So I'm really, really proud of it. Wow. So how long have you been in the business? I've been in the business about 10 years. I've won awards and been nominated for Best Web Starlet as well. And uh, I, I did win um, Best Webcam Girl uh, 2010 as well. So I'm very I'm very successful and I'm very happy oh, with what I'm doing. So you, you still do the webcamming? Oh, that's my that's my lifeblood. I love it. I love so it. where do I do that if I want to watch you? You go to playwithtay.com and uh, you just get a free screen name, sign up, and come see me. Oh, that's easy. Yeah, very easy. <laughs> easy. So, so let me ask you, you, since you've been in the industry so long, what, have you, what do you think about the current situation of the industry? Do you think it's better, worse? Or? Um, I think that it has a chance to be better than it is right now. I think that um, it suffered a little bit of hardship, but as long as the girls and the producers and everyone has, uh, keeps respect for each other and, and values the business and values what they do, then I think it's going to be, it'll be just fine. Now, I, I, you know, like like yourself, many of the girls are doing their own thing now. Yeah. See, before you didn't, you, you couldn't do that. Well, I did. That's the thing. I've been on my own since I was uh, 15, and I've been doing this all by myself. So that's why I say I started this a long time ago, and I got in while it was good. And I think it's going to be a lot harder for um, some of some girls to start now and do do it for with with such a long succession rate as whereas with me I got in while it was good and I built it and I built a brand name out of Taylor Steven. So you so it's just a matter of hard work and working and doing it all it the is, time. It is hard work. Nothing good ever comes easy. You're gonna face challenges which I have and I faced, fought, kicked their ass and moved on. <laughs> so so what do you think what do you think is gonna be the next big thing for the industry? Well, I mean, I think the way the industry is going is webcamming. A lot of girls are doing that. And I think the virtual uh, webcamming as well is something that is new to the industry. And I think that a lot of people will like that. Again, I, I think this, this business, this industry is never going to be gone. It's here. It's here. We all No, it's not going away because I need it. We all love porn. We all love hot, ch hot chicks. And it's going to be here. Just we have to make it worth it. You know, we have to make it valuable for everybody. Right, right. So... You know, I, I, I see where a lot of people are just working independently and they're doing kind of what you're doing. They're building up, you know. Do you think we're done with the superstars? No, I think that independence is great, uh, but you can be your own superstar. I don't believe that you need a company. That's true. I mean, I don't have, I, I am my own company and I think I became a superstar in my own right. So I think that uh, anybody that's independent and strong minded can be the next superstar with or without a company behind them. So it doesn't take a big production company behind you to, to, to at least make money and make a living at this? No, I think that it's just a matter of what you believe. I'm not saying that the companies aren't good. It's just a matter of what you believe. You can use them maybe as a platform or as a stepping stone. But uh, I respect women that are independent and work real hard and can, can do it for themselves. Well, I'm with you on that. Yeah, so. I just actually launched, launched a t-shirt with, um, it's called SuitcasePimpClothing.com and it actually... Wait, wait, what was that again? It's called SuitcasePimpClothing.com. Suitcase Pimp Clothing. Yes, and what it's about is is, uh, it's my shirt uh, with that company, but it's about women being their own. Oh, right on. So independent right. women. And that's why I'm saying to you, I respect women that are independent and can can get what they need. So what's on the t-shirt? Well, the t-shirt's a represent. my t-shirt is a representation of me and all the battles that I've faced, my cancer, my obesity, and it's me taking it out of the picture. And if they actually go to the Go to the site and check out the shirt. You'll be able to see uh, what the shirt means and how it represents me. My fans already know because anyone that knows me knows what I've gone through, so they know. So you're an open book pretty much. I am a very open book. My fans love me for that. So. Well, that, that's awesome. Though. I, mean, I, I can't see you being obese. I was 300 pounds and I was a very confident. No way. Yep. No way. I lost 180 pounds in 2006. Wow. I posed for uh, Voluptuous XL Magazine, all the big girl sites at the time, but my health was at stake and I had to do what I had to do. So, health first. You got you to gotta take care of your health, you know. It's, it's not about filling a niche because you can get work or something, yeah, you know. No, not at all. Actually, I was afraid that I would lose um, fans because I went really? from a BBW fan base to a smaller fan base, but you know, I didn't. I was surprised. I'm surprised how big that group is. It's huge. It is really uh, big. No pun intended. It's a... <laughs> <laughs> it's it is a okay, huge you did it, not me. Uh, no, but no pun intended. It's a huge fan base, and it's a very important one. Yeah. Um, I think curvy women are beautiful. 
I, I think all women are beautiful, so. I, I agree, but I think that curvy women are looked aside, and I think that um, people forget there's a huge BBW fan base, and there, there are is. gorgeous BBWs, and I believe there I was are. a confident BBW at the time, or I wouldn't have posed for a spread in a magazine, right? Well, I mean, even even if you look at TV, you look at, uh, what, uh, what's that show with the, I don't know, what is it? No, not Biggest Losers, the sitcom. With the guy and the girl, and they're both heavy set. Oh, Mike and Molly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I love her. She's hilarious. I love that show. It's good. She's hilarious. I remember her from Gilmore Girls. That's what I remember. Yes. Her. See, you, you have to respect the person who they are on the inside. Exactly. That's beautiful. That's how I feel. Exactly. Yes. So what do you, what do you got planned for the, for the AVN here during this week? Well, I have a lot of interviews I'm signing for my fans. I'm also selling my shirt. Um, I am nominated, so... Uh, yes, I'm very excited about that. How's your fingers, everybody? First, you know, my first nomination with AVN. Ever, really? It's uh, with AVN, so it's really, oh, okay. really okay. cool. And um, also, I'm looking forward to Sunday's football game. Go Patriots! And yeah. Okay, you lost me there. I'm, I'm lost. <laughs> but I, I'm most looking forward to meeting my fans. That's why I'm here. They're, I have the best fans in the world. So. Well, that's awesome. Your fan, and you have your Facebook page and all I have, that. Good. Um, my Twitter is at Tay Stevens, and then of course there's TaySevens.com. Playwithtay.com and suitcasepimclothing.com. <laughs> Perfect. Was there anything else I forgot? No. Yeah, I think you're good. <laughs> wow. I did that in record time. Uh, wait a minute. Okay, just focus on the tits here for a minute then. We got, we got a... Yes, yes. Well, we got a lot of male fans that, uh, like that. <laughs> All right. Well, thank you so much for taking the time. Thank you very much. Bye.